guys, how you doing? How are you feeling? My name is Via, and welcome to my channel. Yeah, a quick disclaimer. I'm sorry if I sound disgusting. It's because I've been a bit hale lately, but life goes on. We can't stop, so I'm not planning on stopping just because I have a little flu. So today I'm gonna do a tutorial, and I'm gonna show you how to turn from this into this but before we go please subscribe leave a like comment down below what do you think and how do you feel I should improve and also don't forget to activate the bell button so you receive a message every time I post a video and now let's begin so first of all what I'm gonna use is this white white pencil blah, blah, blah by NYX. You can wear any white pencil you like and I'm gonna mark where I'm gonna do all my interventions. So yeah, I'm gonna do the ring line. Don't know if you can see, I'm sorry if I'm looking down here, it's because my mirror it's here so it can help me see what I'm doing so yeah I mark everything and I'm not gonna be worried by trying to conceal all my acne marks or whatever because I'm gonna use paint so it would be pointless and I'm gonna waste time about it so I'm gonna start by using this cream color this is by NYX and is yeah it's face and body paints if you guys are interested yeah and I'm gonna cover basically the majority of my face with it. You don't need to use pink, you can use any shade you like. I'm just wearing pink because I want it. I'm not painting my nose because I'm gonna do a little marks there so I'm still deciding what I'm gonna do, so I'm not gonna paint. <laughs> Look at my face. I'm not gonna paint the nose just yet. Another thing, one reason I'm using a pencil. A pencil? <laughs> what? I'm wearing a brush is because <laughs> um, it's easier for me to draw and cover all the areas I like I know it gets a little streaky but what I'm gonna do next is with a little sponge I'm gonna tap it all and fix that little problem Um, some people prefer to block them and I totally understand if you do I just not gonna do this time because I actually like my brows and I like where they're placed so it's a bit convenient to me where they are so that's the reason I'm not blocking them out <laughs> Onto my nose. What I'm gonna do to my nose is I'm gonna draw the nostrils onto the brain area. I'm gonna use a simple clown paint, so it's from this brand. Let me see if you can see. Oh, come on. So I'm not being sponsored, so I'm just showing you for the sake of if you want to wear what I'm wearing, basically. So the thing with some of clown painting and water activated paint is that you need to let it dry for a second. So once I'm done, as you can see, I'm done with the yellow and the pink, I'm gonna do these little bits and bobs here. Quick side note, 
about um, this clown painting I'm wearing and any kind of water activated paint is safe to wear around your eyes so don't feel scared that oh she's applying paint on her eyes yes I know it's safe so don't worry okay all good here now that I let it dry a little what I'm gonna do is I'm wearing this lipstick to paint over this blue because I don't think it's bright enough so um, let's do this and also to cover my lips as you can see overline my lips so it's a good time for your inner drag queen to come out and explore your boundaries you know but seriously, I did it because I have quite thin lips, so to give a bit volume, I overdraw them. painted this with blue um, and since it is lipstick oh god um, I need to let it dry a little so while it's drying I'm gonna wear a yellow shade to start working on this yellow area that should be the brain and the yellow I'm wearing is from yes please a palette from Colourpop and it is focus on the palette please camera and it will be this yellow shade. Now, with the same palette, we have a little orange over here. And that orange is the one I'm using to do some shadow. Now, I'm gonna do the same thing on my eye since I applied also some yellow over here. I'm gonna go again with my white pencil and I'm gonna draw some brain curves. Is that the term? I don't know. Now I'm wearing the red one from the same palette and I'm gonna do some shading white pencil again because this is gonna be your best friend and now I'm gonna draw where I want some light Once you're done, pick up any kind of blending brush and just smudge. Onto the pink part of my skin, I'm going to use... You can use any, again, any kind of pink shadow you want. The one I'm using is from Sugar Trip Squad by NYX and it is this bright one. That. Once my face is done, I'm gonna use from Fenty, from this beautiful highlighter uh, palette. Do you see this rose gold here? This one and this lilac, I'm gonna combine the two of them that I can speak today, and I'm gonna apply here as normal highlighter. So let's do this, guys! I'm gonna apply a little here on my chin, a little on my nose, and on my forehead. I'm gonna use some red clown paint. Um, I'm gonna do like some, how can you say, guts? But it's not guts because guts is from the belly. Some goo, okay? Let's call it goo. I'm gonna do some goo over here in my brain, like some of the things here want to come out and just Say hi to everybody. So, hi Goo, how are you? Feeling good? 
Me too. I'm gonna do a little bit of that here and here. Hi NYX, I'm wearing a white paint. I'm sorry if it's a bit dirty. It's because I use this to mix and do other shades, but there's white here. I'm gonna use some detailing. I decided I'm maybe gonna do some teeth over here. So maybe one or two. Let's just see how it turns out. Now that I'm done with my teeth, with the brownish shade, I'm gonna turn parts of it a little darker, just for the sake of volume. I'm gonna use the blue blood, oh god, I'm gonna use the blue blood palette and I'm gonna use this shade called the Seast to basically shade the mouth. With the Seast I'm gonna use also Blue Monday, so the Seast is this one and Blue Monday is that one, so I'm gonna use both. <laughs> So what I'm gonna do is, back to the Sugar Trip uh, palette, I'm gonna use the pink shade and I'm gonna apply it just to blend where the ink ends and where my lid starts. The center of my lid, I'm thinking about lilac, so I'm gonna apply this one up here on the center. Now again with the blue blood I'm thinking about using yeah I'm thinking about using blue Monday just in the outer corners of my eye just to give them a little bit of shape I guess. Now that that is done I'm gonna go back with my Fenty palette and the lilac shade over here, that's the one I'm gonna use to give some pop on the center of my lid and give it a bit of shine. Now for the inner corner of my eye, I'm gonna use this white. So I'm done. Now it's time for the fun part, which is drawing with your eyeliner. The ones that I'm using it will be the Vivid Bright, the blue color one from NYX, and also this one, that it is, this shirt. So, blue one first, I'm gonna apply on my eye. Once that's done, pick up your black eyeliner. So I'm gonna outline everything on the eyes. I'm just gonna do the down line here. And again, with the white paint, I'm gonna do some details. For example, here. So this is it, guys. This is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did because I had a blast doing this. And it's time to finish the video. So leave a like, please leave a like because that helps me a lot. Comment down below what you think. If you have any ideas, feel free to share. Share this with your friends because that helps my juice going. And feel free to follow me on my social media because I post a lot of my routine and my pets there. And I'll see you next time. So, bye! Boom. <laughs>